Hi, I'm Willie with H5 Technology and welcome to my channel. Thank you for being here. I appreciate each and every one of you. Tonight what we're going to talk about is setting up our voicemail and our recordings on our extension that we set up in the last video. And we're going to do this from the phone that we set up. So if you're like me, a lot of times you screw up your voicemail message a dozen times because you're not prepared and you're trying to remember which button to hit and it just it becomes a, a mess right so what I've done is I've created a document that I'm gonna put a link to down in the description and it breaks out describes the options of the voicemail menu and how to get there so just so you know when I show you uh, or when I hold the phone up and we go to um, push the button you can't really see it really well here but there's a little envelope icon on all of your Grandstream phones. Um, in fact, here is here is my daily driver, which is the GXP uh, 2170, and there is the the voicemail, the message envelope there, and it looks like that on um, all Grandstream phones with the buttons. So we're using the uh, the lower end phone. The uh, this one's a 1625, the GXP 1625, the same one we set up last time, but this is this is you know more of a budget phone and the uh, GXP uh, 2170. That's a little bit of a of a higher end phone, but regardless, the voicemail or the message button looks the same. So you're gonna hear the prompts and we're gonna walk through it. And here's our little cheat sheet, and right here I have an accurate representation of that button. So we are going to walk through all of these real quick. Now, you saw that we had password verification disabled for this extension. So if you, have, if you didn't have password verification disabled for the extension, the user would have to put in their voicemail password. So you would have to make sure that you know that. You can also get to my voicemail by uh, dialing star 97. So if I uh, dial star 97, the, uh, the phone will you have no messages. Press two to log us into voicemail. The same as hitting the message uh, you envelope. Have no messages. Press two so that's where we're going to start. Since we've got uh, the message button, if you were using like another IP phone that maybe doesn't have that, um, you would just dial star 97 or configure a message button to do star 97. So here we go. We're going to hit the message button, voicemail button. You have no messages. And we're going to hit press zero. To change folders. Press, press one to record your unavailable message. Now, press two we're going to press one message. to press record the to unavailable record message. Name. Press four to after the tone say your unavailable message and then press the pound key. You've reached Willie Howe. I am unavailable to take your call. Please leave your name, number, and a brief message, and I will call you back as soon as possible. Thank you. I pressed press pound. To accept this recording. I'm going to press, press two to listen to, to, it. Listen to press it. three to... You've reached Willie Howe. I am unavailable to take your call. Please leave your name, number, and a brief message, and I will call you back as soon as possible. Press okay. one to accept now this Now we're going to go ahead and accept press it. Press two to... Your message has been so that's my unavailable. Message. Now we're going to record our busy message. You've reached Willie Howe, and I am super duper uber busy, and I can't take your call, but I really want to talk to you, so please leave a message with your name and number, and have a wonderful day, and I'll call you back as soon as I can. Thank you. Press one I'm going to press to 1 to accept recording. it. Okay, now I'm press just going to record my name. Your unavailable message. Press two after the tone. Say your name and then press the pound key. Willie Howe. Thank you. Press one to accept this recording. I'm going to press accept that. To your message has been now, saved. Now, press one to record your unavailable message. I am not message. going to. Press two to record. I am not going to record a temporary greeting. You can, you know, if you want to record your unavailable and you're busy and use those year round, you know, temporary. You can throw that in there so it doesn't overwrite the other ones. Um, and then 
five will let you change your voicemail password or we can do a star and then a pound so we'll go back into there so that we can see the star and the pound so we'll go back into our message you have no zero to record your unavailable message. now we don't want to record any messages we want to hit star to record your name press two to change folders press three for advanced options and then pound goodbye and that's it that's all there is to it so you uh you know if you're if you're prepared and you know i probably sat here uh and thought about those messages for a long time which is why i ran straight through it didn't have to uh re-record it if that if you know if recording a message makes you nervous you know um you know have a shot of whiskey if you're of legal age uh i'm just kidding that might help some people uh but uh, you could also get a you know get a notepad write it down what you want to say so you can go straight through it a lot of people don't like the way they sound on the phone but it's a voicemail and it is what it is unless you're going to pay somebody else to record your voicemail which you could i'm sure we've all called you know uh, a friend's office and we were expecting a male voice on the other end and the voicemail prompt is female because maybe the secretary or someone else recorded it but that's it this little guide should get you through there so no matter what you do you know have fun with it make sure uh, you get your voicemail set up and if you like this video please give me a thumbs up please subscribe please comment and share please follow me on twitter and instagram if you need voice over ip network or uh, security consulting you can reach us at h5llc.com we also have a discord channel you can come on over charlie is our admin and he does a fantastic job for us we also have an amazon shop down there where all of the products that we use here on the channel can be found once again i do appreciate you and we will see you in the next video